Oh man, I don't have a script for this video. I don't have any sort of freaking any sort of script or any sort of organization for this video. This is pretty crazy. This is incredible. I'm so happy right now. Oh, my camera says low battery. I finished 104 yesterday. Uh, last night. You good, Bindi? Bindi's. <laughs> Bindi, you good, Bindi? Hey. Bindi, you good, Bindi? Hey, baby. A lot of you are wondering what's next, what crazy project that you have planned next. I finished 104, I finished editing the days yesterday, last night, September 2nd, 2022. When I X'd out of all of my windows and all the tabs, I started crying. I didn't think I would, but it was just like a feeling down there and like I was sitting in my bed. I powered off my laptop, closed it, and it was like, it was just this feeling that was like from, from my stomach or something and it just went and it went up and then I came out as tears. It's very unexplainable, very weird. It was just such a special moment for me and I am so grateful that I was able to do everything that I could have, that, that, I, that I did during 104 because I did a lot and it shows, I think. I, th I, I like to think that it shows that how much I did, how much I did with my friends and how much my friends actually did with me. And it was one of those things where you work so hard on and where, where your life revolves around it for such a long time and that's pretty much all you're thinking about and working on up to that moment where it's finally the end of it and you just work so hard for that one moment and it was like everything just came back in like a huge flashback in my eyes in in my brain and everything just everything just like exploded and it was such an incredible moment where i was sitting there in silence and once I finished the video, when, when I finished editing it, it was actually a feeling that I've never, I don't think I've ever felt before because I feel like I've grown so much since the beginning of 104, during it, and especially after. A very confusing feeling as well, very excited feeling, but it was, it's, it's like, it was such a hard project to do but I powered through it and having it be over, I feel like I don't have much of a purpose for anything anymore. I mean, yeah, I start, I try, I try thinking of new ideas and stuff and I have so many ideas, but it's like this one project came to an end and it was like one of the biggest, it's the biggest, I don't know why I said it's one of the biggest. Am I stupid? It's the biggest and it's over. I did it. A lot of you are wondering what I'm going to do next. What project? And I know a lot of you are curious and I do have an answer for you. I legit do have an answer for you. And it's simple. Drum roll, please. This is it. This is the moment. I don't know. I really don't know. You're thinking 365? 365 days of beep 2 bot While that is a good idea, I feel like I'm going to need to do 365 days of beep 2 bot when I have an editor. There's no way I'm going to be able to do 365 myself, by myself, like I did with 104. Because I edited every single video from 100, except for one. I didn't edit day number three. I, that was my friend, but he didn't want to edit anything else, I don't think so. I just took the wheel from there. I realized how hard this was and it was very fun. I feel like I wanna do something else. I wanna, I, I think the day projects, like so-and-so days of Beauty Bot, I feel like that is over. 104 is the finale and I feel like that's it. I don't know if that makes you sad or not, but I will always upload videos. And uh, if I do upload daily, I won't name it. <laughs> I. Although I do love naming my projects and naming everything that I do, but I feel like just if I do upload daily, I'm just gonna, it's just gonna be Beep Tweebot. That's it. Beep Tweebot. Daily uploads. Boom. I think 104 has its name because it was daily uploads, yes, but also there's a story behind it and there's meaning behind it. The next thing, of course, is going to be a story 
kind of narrative based kind of thing but it won't be it, it might be a daily thing but it won't have so and so days of beeps we bought i want to move past that i want to i want to do something else have a different kind of project I just know that whatever I do work on, whatever I do start, it will be much more ambitious than anything that I've ever worked on. I will probably try to work on only bangers on Beats We Bought and uh, I'll be working on the ASMR channel. You can find me there as well. Yeah, that's probably about it. On Beats We Bought, I will do, I will work on much more ambitious projects, like I said. Like uh, one single video at a time, one banger after the other, long videos, nice, put some money into it probably as well. Way more ambitious projects. You can you you can be expecting some good old, good quality beep to bot content coming up. Similar to the camping videos, right? Just like those kind of long videos, a lot of effort into them. I wanna try to put those camping videos that I'm so proud of to shame uh, in quality wise, regarding quality. And I'm very excited to do it, but whether it's YouTube, whether it's something else, I don't know what it's going to be. I will definitely let you know there are a bunch of announcements coming. There are tons of announcements coming, but other than that, probably weekly videos, weekly uploads, sometimes more. It might be a different day. It might be Wednesday, every Wednesday, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> All I do know is that I'm way more accustomed to making videos now and I can just throw one together easily. But 365 of them, that is such a good idea, but I will <laughs> probably explode. <laughs> I will need some more help if I do do 365 because dude, my social life, is nothing right now. All I do is hang out with my friend Gage and that's pretty much it. I <laughs> need to make friends, man. I wanna go out, just have a job. <laughs> make sure you binge all of 104 days of Beauty Bot so this could possibly be my job later on. You never know. I, I don't really know. I have a bunch of things laid out, written down in my notebook, like different things that I wanna do. You never know, it could be another huge YouTube project. It could be 10 days of Beat2Bot 2. It could be 30 days of Beat2Bot 2. Leave your ideas down in the comments. I will probably start on 365, but that will take literally forever. If I do start on 365, I will take my time. I will take my time with it. And I might name it something else, to be honest. Getting tired of these damn numbers. I looked at numbers for two years. Numbers that never passed up 104. Drives a person crazy, I'm telling you. It could be more YouTube projects. It could be music. It could be movies and acting. It could be anything. I will literally do anything because, you know, I, I like doing other things as well. Um, on top of YouTube. Whatever can help the YouTube grow, whatever can help me grow. Anyway, anyhow, anyway, anywhere. <laughs> after this video, obviously, there, after 30 days of Bot, there was a What Now video like this, and that was pretty much the end of it. Um, but that's not the case for this one. There is still more 104 content coming. There are like two or three videos left. After this video, there's one huge special blooper video that I would love to do. I have it all laid out. All I gotta do is put it all together and edit it. There is also another very long video coming out October 1st. I don't know when the blooper show is gonna come out. I'll just figure that out, but it's coming soon. After those few videos come out, I will probably take a little bit of a break. Again, I need it. I need to figure stuff out. I might upload a video here and there. More often than I did last time, after 30 days of B2Bot, I won't just disappear. I don't think I shouldn't. Yeah, go rewatch every single video in 104. Um, I still have one video to do for the story as the finale. I want to take my time on this video, so that video is going to come out. It's going to kind of be out of nowhere. Thank you guys so much for so much fun and so many great opportunities. It seemed like 2022 was the year that 104 was meant to come out on. I just loved how this worked out. Everything just kind of fell into place this year. If I would have waited until next year, I feel like it just wouldn't, it just wouldn't be the same. Obviously it might've, you never know, it might've worked out even better if I started releasing 104 next year, but I feel like it was meant to be for 2022. And I think I did everything right. I think I did everything right. This is it. This is the end of it. I'm just looking at my camera. 
taking it all in. Yeah, that's it. <sighs> Say the outro. Say the outro. I think that the next thing for me to say, logically, would be to reintroduce the message and the meaning of 104 to you. And uh, it's just to do what you like, do what you love, and just follow your dreams, I said at one point. <laughs> And find happiness in the dumbest things while also entertaining people. That's really all I really want to do ever in my life. And that's all I want from the world is to enjoy my work and that hopefully will inspire you to ask yourself, who am I and what do I want from life? And that is the end of it. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later with more content. And thank you so much for watching. I love you guys and bye-bye. What could be next? I said movies, acting, I said a new YouTube project, I said music, what about sports? Yeah. Hey Siri! FaceTime Waffle. Making a FaceTime call to Waffle home. Today's the day. You ready for this ball? Been waiting ever since I called you out two years ago. I'm knocking back so hard, you'll be doing Call of Duty videos again. And this fight is going to be so scarring. It's going to be more scarring than when your math teacher swore at you. You ready? Absolutely. Beep Tweebot.